Hi, I'm Kevin Hill, and today I thought we would do another fun painting, so let's get started. We'll start off today with a small amount of red on the one inch brush. A tiny, tiny little bit. And we'll come right here and just paint in a nice little pink glow right here at the horizon. Now, with the one-inch brush and a little bit of blue and black and white, I want to come up here to the corners and just drop in the rest of the sky. Now, when you're done with that, you can just blend out the whole sky, just like this. Now, with a little bit of white on the one-inch brush, we can come up here and drop in couple little clouds. Just a little. We don't need a whole bunch up here. And maybe, maybe one over here. Now when you're done with that, you can come along and just blend out the bottom. Just like that. Tiny circles. And then we can fluff the top. Just lift it right up. And then blend it back down, just like that. And do the same to the rest of the clouds. Now back to the brush that had the red on it. And I want to underpaint some water down here. Just like that. Drop it right in. Now with the one inch brush and some blue and red and white. We can come right over here just tap in a nice little hill back here, just like that. Keep it nice and light. This is going to be far away. Now I'm going to add a little bit of black and a little bit more blue to that color. And I want to make another hill that comes right down in front of that one, just like that. Push it right back. Now with the fan brush and some dark color, mostly blue and red, I want to come right up here and just tap and drop in a couple of nice little pine trees just right there at the horizon. Just by tapping and working down. Now when you're done with that, you can drop in a couple of larger pine trees right here just by tapping. And maybe another one right over here. Now with the clean brush, I'm going to grab the bottom of those trees and just pull them down. Create some reflections. And same over here. Grab these and pull them down. And then we'll go across. Now with the one inch brush, and I'm going to load a little bit of dark color and pop in a couple of little bushes back here. Just like that. And maybe, maybe we'll have a couple over here. So we'll just block those in. Now with the fan brush, I'll go through a little bit of white. And I want to put a little tiny little bit of snow back here. Just like that. We don't need much. That's far away. Just a little. Load a little bit more paint. And drop some snow over here. Now with the one inch brush and a little bit of white, we can drop a tiny little bit of highlight up here. Just like that. Just by pushing and get these nice little highlights. Now with the fan brush and a little bit of blue and white, we can drop a little, tiny little bit of highlight up here. Not a whole lot. These are still pretty far away. Just drop a little. Now with the one inch brush and some white, we can come right here and kind of clean up those trees. Grab a little bit of that color 
We'll just pull it. And we can also shape our water. Now with a little bit of white on the knife, we can drop in a nice little water line back here, just by rubbing. Now with a little bit of brown and white on the knife, we can just drop in a little tree trunk, just a tiny little bit. Now with the fan brush and a little bit of white, we can drop just a tiny little bit of highlight right on the top of the branches, just like that, tiny, tiny little bit. Don't want to overdo, and you do want to leave some dark, and let it get darker toward the bottom. We'll do a little on this one, same way. Now with the one inch brush, and a little bit of white, we can just drop a tiny little bit of highlight up here on these bushes, just by pushing. Now with a little bit of brown on the knife, I think I want a nice big tree up here. So we'll just drop one in. Tiny little roll of paint on the knife, and just drop it right in. Now with some brown and white on the knife, we can add just a little bit of highlight to this tree, just like that. Let the paint break. Now with some brown and a script liner, we can come up here and add just a few little limbs just hanging off the tree. Drop them right in. Now back to the one inch brush, and we can just clean up the bottom of those trees. Grab a little bit of the color and just pull it. Now we can go back to the script liner and throw in some nice little grassy things that are kind of sticking out. Maybe the snow isn't too deep right here. And we can see a few little pieces of grass coming out. Alright, well I think we're done. I had a lot of fun. I hope you did too. Don't forget to check out my DVD for sale. I'll put the link below. And if you have Facebook, look me up there. I'll put that link below too. And thanks for watching.